Dominic Cahoon is the latest free agent to join the Edmonton Oilers, signing a one-year deal. The 25-year-old will be entering his third season of play in the NHL whenever the Oilers in the league get started. I, I think the book on on Cahoon is he's more of a playmaker than a goal scorer, but he's a, a player who can play with really good players. So he's a complimentary player, a support player, and which is what the Oilers need. Um, I suspect he may be a younger Tyler Ennis. You know, he's 25 and, you know, Tyler's 30. So maybe he's a younger Tyler Ennis. And the price for the orders is right. $975,000 and fits under the salary cap. And that's always been the, the lure for players. Uh, with the chance, you know, to be on the same team as McDavid and, and Dreisaitl. I think it's a stretch to say that, you know, these players sign because they get there's a chance they could play with Leon or Connor. They have to be good enough to do to do that. Uh, in Cahoon's case, he played a fair bit with Malkin in Pittsburgh. Almost one shift, he said he played with Crosby, and Crosby got hurt, so he was able to play with with Malkin, and Malkin liked him. So if you can play with Malkin, I'm sure you can play with Dreisaitl. He's a much cheaper replacement for Athanasio, who was coming off a $3 million contract. They've got Cahoon at a third of that. So I think, you know, in terms of fiscal responsibility, that's a good deal. Cahoon's signing also answers the question of what moves the orders needed to make to address their forward depth in the top six. And with which center would he be best suited to play alongside? Dreisaitl or Connor McDavid? Not McDavid's. Dry sidle. And I, you know, he could also drop down to the third line too if Kyle Turris is a third line center. He's an offensive center. So I think in, in the Oilers' case, they may feel they've got a top nine with some offensive players in the third line and, a, and then a fourth line with some penalty killers and such. Dry sidle makes more sense. I think you have to start the season with Nugent Hopkins and McDavid again. Although, you know, certainly Nugent Hopkins played tremendously well for a couple of months with Leon Dreisaitl, but I think in the short term you start with uh, with Ryan Nugent Hopkins on left wing. Before joining the Blackhawks in 2018, Cahoon played four years in German pro hockey and has also been a frequent teammate of Leon Dreisaitl on the German national team. They got together when they were about 14 years old and were getting 200 points a year. As Cahoon told me on the phone, there were a lot of teams that weren't very good in that league and there were some games where they won 20 to nothing. And uh, Leon and, and Cahoon both got 13 points. So they have a history. Uh, they have also played internationally together on German uh, national teams. So I think there would be a certain comfortability with Leon and Cahoon and that Leon wouldn't have to wonder what Cahoon's going to do because Cahoon has played with him before and kind of knows what how Leon thinks the game. I think Cahoon, is, as I said earlier, is more of a playmaker than a shooter. Leon is a, is a shooter who plays center, unlike a lot of centers who, you know, who score 30 goals and get 60 assists. You know, I think Leon is the kind of player who can get between 40 and 50 goals. So on that line, Leon could be the shooter and Cahoon could be the playmaker uh, as a winger goes. 